Hi everybody, I hope you're very, very well. Okay, so, you know, you come across in your life, you come across some really talented people and uh, and you just like, you say, my God, this little kid is blessed or this person is really blessed to have uh, something that God has given them, which is just truly amazing. And uh, I have to, I've already introduced you once before to Jocelyn Saraf. Uh, she's going to be 13 soon. And I've known her for about, I think, five years now. And she just is the most brilliant artist. Beautiful. This is one of her works. Let me, let me see if I can. There you are. If you can see it. Close up. Beautiful, huh? She's 12 years old. Too stunning. I love it. She made it for me. And, uh, yeah, I'll put that up in a bit. And the new blooming artist in, our, in my life is my granddaughter, Anushka. She has drawn, she's written Abhi, she calls me Abhi. She's drawn a fairy. <laughs> That's me. The, don't miss the curly hair, the wings. Amazing, huh? <laughs> I... I will treasure this all my life, both of them, because uh, Jocelyn that made that just for me and so did Anushka. So anyway, so young talent, we have to, have to just give it to them. Yeah, so put that back up. It was looking a little too blank. Anyway, and also it's done with UV colors. So if I put a little UV light on it, it'll just uh, be a magical, magical picture. As it is, it is. <laughs> and cuteness personified. And uh, both of them have, uh, you know, Insta pages and where they have showcased their work. Um, little Nushki, I call her, my granddaughter. Nushki is five years old. <laughs> and you have to see, it's, I think... Uh, Nushka underscore Wonderland. I'll give the I'll give the link on top on the post. You have to see what goes through a little child's mind, you know, how she perceives the world and how she perceives her aunts and her grandmoms and she's got quite a few grandmoms and and all of that. It's just the uh, through the eyes of a five year old. It's just so brilliant. I just love it. So anyway, so today actually I'm I want to speak to you about two things. Of course, I want you to introduce the two artists in my life, but also um, wanted to speak to you about expiry dates on my products, the AP products, the new lot in and whatever. So there are a few products that the shelf life is uh, November. It's another seven, eight months from now. And, um, and people are paranoid. Ma'am, there's only nine months on the product. I'm like, you have nine months on the product. Come on. You know, um, because once you open the product, there are people who are saying, ma'am, I'm using the product for like uh, nine to ten months. Well, good for you if you've managed to stretch your product that long. But uh, ideally, when you open any skincare product, try to use it within the first three months of opening it, whatever the, um, you know, your expiry date is. Um, I want to tell you that it's safe to use till the expiry date absolutely safe to use actually most of my products are three years shelf life but I have uh, told them to just put two years shelf life so you know so I I know when to order what to order and um, and I will pull it off if it gets three to four months close to the shelf life but as it is we haven't gotten there as yet but even if you do get a product of mine which has uh, seven, eight months on it, nothing to worry about, you know, unless uh, somebody had messaged me and said, ma'am, I want the hyaluronic acid cream. And I said, well, it's, and they wanted three or four uh, of the same um, uh, product. And I said, listen, uh, it's got nine months on it, but uh, just wait till the new batch comes in and the new batch is coming in in another two weeks. And then you can order three and four uh, products of the same if you want to buy it for yourself. Then it just stretches on for about two years. Yeah, so um, so that is something that I wanted to speak to you about because there are people who are hectic. If you're very very hectic about getting a product which is 
got a year, <laughs> a two year shelf life on it. Please ask me first, ma'am, what is the shelf life on this product? I will tell you. Yeah. So uh, that is one thing. Another is, um, you know, since lockdown lifted, um, couriers, I've been talking about this many times, couriers to a lot of parts in India are just not going. And the one courier that seems to be going is Shadowfax. And Shadowfax is takes its own sweet time. I have to tell you, I don't even know who to speak to <laughs> because they really, really are slow. But they are the only ones who go to certain pin codes. And that is why I actually um, send it by Shadowfax. Because if I don't, then you just won't get your product. We'll just need to keep waiting till this COVID situation gets better. Um, so that's these are two things that I wanted to speak to you about. Uh, there are a lot of products um, slowly. I try to order the products as soon as there are like about 150 left. I I then place my next order. So so then sometimes it goes on saying sold out. But even if it's sold out in about two to three weeks, it'll be back in. Unfortunately, uh, unfortunately, the wild rose conditioner is um, has been sold out for about one and a half months. That's also because of the container. I can't get that pink flip cap. You know, when we when you first ordered the golden saffron uh, gel, you got it in a white, um, you know, air pump uh, container. And now it's gone on to gold. It's not that I like to keep sh uh, shifting and changing my, um, <clears throat> you know, my uh, containers. But uh, since COVID hit, uh, law, all the manufacturers went into making only sanitizer bottles and everything else was on the back burner so a lot of people like myself had a big problem trying to get what we wanted for our products and um, i must say it's been a huge struggle yeah so and i was like no for for um for the wild rose conditioner i want the pink flap and if you want the pink pink flap you have to just keep waiting so i've just well, if you just before you order anything, just ask me first for the PDF. And even if you have an old PDF, ask for the new PDF. So you will see what is sold out and what isn't. And then you can ask me. So anyway, so um, I hope you're all very, very well and very, very safe. You know, that is really important. Um, I think uh, every single child who shows uh, it doesn't necessarily have to be painting or drawing any kind of ex any kind of excellence in anything um, or even if she is she's a great dance she loves to dance or she loves to do you know uh, Jocelyn's younger sister who was really little loves to dance and she's a great dancer yeah so uh, these are things that we just have to encourage her parents put her in a dance school and Meher is just like a brilliant dancer now, you know. So uh, that's the thing. So uh, we need to uh, keep our eyes and eyes open and ears open to see what is the child more inclined to do, you know. And uh, definitely, definitely um, give her more encouragement. Um, and, um, you know, I think it's brilliant when and especially when you are you've got that gift in your hands that God has given you. Make good, good use of it. <laughs> I, I'm a very late bloomer. <laughs> I didn't know what I was good at till really late in life. And uh, yeah, well, thankfully I made something of my life. Um, but nowadays, you know, the kids are much more with it and they know exactly what they want to do and how they want. And I've been, uh, you know, telling this, um, uh, Jocelyn and Meher are actually Sandhu's nieces and um, you know I've been telling Sandhu please I hope she goes to a great college like Parsons or something where you know this kind of art and she will just get in without a problem I know that my daughter Kavi went to Parsons in New York it was really difficult for her to get in but she really tried hard and got in so uh, you know what the child wants to do is what they should do uh, instead of us saying now nah, you want to be a become an engineer and be a doctor be a this thing be a that thing i think especially the creative souls just let them fly with it anyway 
I shall uh, see you all very, very soon. And um, please stay safe and happy. Bye-bye.